Jelly Beans introduces children to the world of numbers in a fun but structured game format. There are three basic levels of play. Level 1 begins with simple counting. For example, a 5 and 3 are rolled on the dice. Count the dots out loud, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Then count those number of spaces on the number line, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and place a marble on that number. The first player who fills in 10 of their 12 spaces wins. Then we move on to level 2 with simple adding and subtracting. Using the 5 and 3, I'll place the 5 above the number 5 on the number line and the 3 to the other side of the plus sign so that it shows we move up the number line and 5 plus 3 will give us the 8. Using the 3 on the other side of the minus, we move down the number line to show that 5 minus 3 will give us a 2. The first player to fill in 10 of the 12 spaces wins. The third and highest level uses three dice and will require applying problem solving to the basic adding and subtracting facts. A player must fill in their answers on the number line in order from 1 to 12 and then remove them from 12 to 1 in order to win. To place a marble on a number, the player may make the number by using one of the face value of the three dice or add or subtract two or three of the dice together to make the answer. They keep their turn as long as they can continue making answers in order from the numbers on the dice. For example, a 1, 2, and 3 are rolled on the dice. The player can begin by placing a marble on the 1 because the number 1 has been rolled. The same is true for the 2 and the 3. Play continues, however, because 3 plus 1 equals 4, and 3 plus 2 is 5, and adding all three numbers together, we get a total of 6. As you can see, Jelly beans can start children out with numbers with simple counting, but progress onward until they are doing simple adding and subtracting along with problem solving. What a great way to introduce children to math.